elimination so hopman elimination takes place when we have different cases first case if base is bulky base is bulky for example now see this base base is bulky if base is bulky then again see this carbon is alpha carbon beta this is beta 1 and beta 2 these are same this is different if we remove the hydrogen then we get this molecule and if we remove from this side these are same then we have these molecules this is less substituted alkene this is more substituted alkene but you know as base is bulky that cannot attack on this hydrogen rather it attack on least hindered hydrogen that's why this one is major product and this is minor product means least substituted alkene is formed as the major product if base is bulkier base is large in size so case one is when base is bulky hoffman elimination takes place <laughs> number two when leaving group is a poor leaving group when leaving group is a poor leaving group like fluorine like fluorine nr3 positive sr to positive so if leaving group is a poor leaving group like fluorine nr3 positive sr2 positive for example we have two fluorobutane with methoxide ion then we get two products because it has two types of beta hydrogens if we remove beta hydrogen from left side we get it one in if we remove from right side product from this butuin this is hoffman product and this is sergia product hoffman product is the major product because we have fluorine as the leaving group which is a poor leaving group if leaving group is fluorine and are three positive or sr2 positive then hoffman product is dominating over sergef then hoffman product is dominating over sergef product sergef product is minor product and hoffman product is major product if it is the case when gamma carbon is crowded when gamma carbon is heavily substituted then product formed is as per hoffman rule so what is third case when gamma carbon is highly substituted we have two choices hydrogen is removed from this side because this is highly crowded so again this is hoffman product this is sergia product so hoffman product is dominating because gamma carbon is highly substituted last case is when beta carbon contains at least one or more than one double bond then again product formed is as per hoffman rule see if we look at it 
it has only one hydrogen two hydrogen so according to sergey rule bond double bond should be on this side but as per hoffman rule double bond should be on this side as per this double bond if we remove this hydrogen then there is now conjugated double bonds and if we remove hydrogen from other side this is isolated double bond double bond separated by more than one single bond is isolated double bond and double bond adjacent to it are called conjugated double bonds and conjugated dienes are more stable than isolated dienes so this is the major product and this is minor product this is hoffman elimination this is sergeff elimination so hoffman elimination is dominating over sergeff elimination these are the four cases where hoffman elimination is dominating